Are you alone all day long with your Doberman? Do you try to get outside, but you just find that now you're just outside and alone with your Doberman because, well, nobody understands your obsession with your dog? Well, we even have a solution for that. Yep, that's right. We're going to find you some friends, not just any friends, some friends that understand your obsession with your Doberman. Yep, some people might call us a little bit obsessive about this breed, but me personally, I take that as a compliment. So I think it's time that we get out there and find some fellow Doberman obsessed fanatics out there who, you know, just kind of get us right here on Doberman Planet. I got a really special treat for you today. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling like getting out of here. I'm feeling a little cooped up. What do you say we go out and have a little bit of fun and catch up with a local Doberman meetup group? Wait, what? There are other Doberman owners out there who are just as crazy as us? Uh, that was weird. Uh, yes, little mini self guy. Yes, there are. These meetup groups actually are pretty awesome. These are groups all around the country where Doberman owners get together and they just hang out together and everyone's welcomed, especially their dogs. And here where I live in Northern California, there's a group called the NorCal Doby Crew who gets together about once a month and they have uh, some sort of adventure with their dogs. And I thought I'd tag along today on their trip out to Fort Funston in San Francisco just to see what it's all about. So let's get going. We just got here to the NorCal Doberman Crew meetup. There's a lot of Dobermans out here. They're running around having fun and uh, I'm definitely uh, in my element. So let's get going and see if we can have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Dr. Speak. Dr. Speak. Hey, Speak. Speak. Come back. Come back. Turn up. Well guys, we made it down to the beach. All these dogs are running around having a blast going in and out of the water. We went down this big cliff over here, let me show you. Went all the way down that thing with all the dogs, they did really good. And uh, they're just having a blast out here with all these other Dobermans and all these other owners just getting to know each other. Right, okay. Not, 
Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, so I just want to introduce you to Jen of the NorCal Dobie Crew. Uh, she kind of helps organize this, right? What do you do for NorCal Dobie Crew? Yeah, so I help manage the uh, social media page, NorCal Dobie Crew on Instagram, and also help lead some of the meetups that we have. So pretty much every other month, I am organizing a meetup, choosing a location, time for meetup, and spreading the word. And it's all done through Instagram mostly? Yeah, primarily through Instagram. So if people were like interested in finding a meetup like this near them, but they're not here in California, they're in other states, where would be a good place to like start searching at least? Would it be like I would Instagram, say, yeah. social media? Yeah, Instagram is a great place to start, at least in California. I know we have NorCal Adobe Crew, there's a Bay Area Adobe Crew, okay. uh, SoCal Adobe Crew, and I think Doberman Pride may also have meetups here in California as well. And they're all updating people via Instagram usually? Yeah, yeah. Okay. to my knowledge, at least that's what we do okay. is via Instagram. Okay. Cool. So if somebody wanted to come out to one of these or this like this group and come be a part of it, do they just show up? Do they need to contact you first or, could, or is anyone invited anytime? Anyone's invited anytime. You can just show up if you wanted to message us like, hey, we're running a couple minutes late, then we definitely try and wait for everyone to meet up. And yeah, anyone's welcome. Cool, hang around a little longer if they, if they need a few more minutes before they show up. Very cool. Well, this is awesome. I'm having a blast. Thank you so much for having me today. Thanks, John. Appreciate you joining us. Whew, man, I am a little tired, but that was a lot of fun. Did you see how many Doberman owners were in that group? That was too cool. There really are a lot of benefits to finding a local meetup group such as this NorCal Adobe group that I found here in California. Um, if you find one near you, I mean, it, it just really provides a great sense of community. It's an excellent socialization event for your dog, and you get to find a lot of times really cool dog-friendly places that you just never knew existed. This Fort Funston place we went to, I had no idea that that was here, and it's a very dog-friendly place. And on top of that, you get to hang out with a lot of Doberman owners who have a lot of great advice and tips on raising these dogs. And we know how unique this breed is, and unique dogs Really sometimes you need some unique tips and unique advice and these people understand what you're going through. Unfortunately right now you do need to do a little bit of digging to find one of these groups near you. There's not really a good resource that I found where they're all listed but if and when I do find one I will definitely list it in the description down below this video so if you're watching this video far in the future definitely look in the description you might have a good resource down there but for now you're best off checking social media like Instagram, Facebook, maybe even good old-fashioned Google and type in things like you know your state meetup group like Florida Doberman Meetup Group or Colorado Doberman Meetup Group. And you might be surprised at what you find. These things are, these meetups are all over the place. We sure had a lot of fun today. I mean, did you see that scenery down there at the beach? Man, that was beautiful. Wait, hey John, are you talking about the beautiful Doberman scenery out there? Or the boring cliffs in the beach? A weird little mini self is back. Yes, little weird mini self guy. I was definitely talking about the Dobermans. We're Doberman nuts, remember? Yeah, that's true. What a weird little guy. I hope you had a lot of fun today. I really did. And you know, if you love learning about this breed or just seeing these beautiful dogs in action, then definitely hit the subscribe button down below and the little bell icon next to it. That way you won't miss our next adventure here on Doberman Planet. I'll see you guys next time. See you later. Okay, we'll see you next time. Take care.